now. He'd be so happy to see us and Carlito. Happy to see you and Carlito, maybe. Enough of that nonsense. Empty. What is up, guys? Welcome back. It's going to be uh, Far Cry 6, episode 18. So nice we're, one, uh, Danny. Admiral Benitez is pissed off and has her troops well, hold working on. double all across El Este. Someone's talking Sounds over like me, Sounds like we have her right where we want her. Meet me at El Agujero. I want to go over my attack plan. Anyway, welcome back to uh, Far Cry 6, episode uh, is 18. And uh, we're just going to get right through the story. Hopefully, this is uh, we're coming up to the end. And we'll have the um, legends officially on our side. I'm gonna see if can, this can go all the way over there and park it. I guess I'm not. Taking the hotel. I've been telling this. Gilberto has a chameleon getting inside the hotel. I need to tell you the plan. Thanks to you, Benit. Rendezvous with El Tigre at the place I marked on your map. remember right this is like a Yarman mission but I Yara whatever I said I was gonna do these later but I think you get the um the chicharron chicharron there which I like chicharron Some intel you, you could use. Danny, we got guns. We got bullets. 
and a perfect site for an ambush. What we need is your know-how. Join us. Thanks a lot. So you want to humiliate the army all by yourself? Idiota! You're never satisfied! How dare you? I do everything you want and this is how you thank me? What do you want? <coughs> you see what? Rápido! Chicharro has run off to fight the dog army alone? No, no matter. So boring. Don't do this. Don't do this. Hey, you. Help me. Good ass. No hay problema. type I see. And not a big fan of evil dogs, apparently. The dogs, of course. Dogs are going to tear him to pieces. Oh. <laughs> 
doing that wrong in the beginning. Sorry about that, guys. Did I kill him? I don't need that that bar. I don't know if it's his health or if it's the percentage of dogs that are that are being killed. I have no idea. Oh, 
Okay, so that was his self. At first, I thought Jerome it was survived. the other way around. Please, tore them apart. I've never seen anything like it. Once Soldado Blood touched Chicharro's beak, he was never the same. But now, I can trust that he has found a companion who will protect him on his quest for justice. Protection? It's fucking terrifying. Paint his name on the water tower. Let all who come know and fear the name Chicharro. Um, sure. Do you want us back on the farm? I will come to you. Chicharron's blood loss for justice has only just begun. Gracias, Danny. Nothing will stand between Chicharron and his brain. Neither living nor dead nor paper. All right, Chicharron, lead the way. I love this character. <laughs> Chicharron's awesome. Chicharron hates dogs, soldados, and bananas. was my day? Well, I followed a bloodthirsty rooster into combat after he blew up a truck. You too?
Hola. The files have all been destroyed. Chicharron is fine. And the soldados? No survivors. It was a bit of a bloodbath, to be honest. Chicharron's favorite type of bath. Don't forget to pay Chicharron's name to mark his victory against the soldados. The higher, the better. I'm heading to you now. That mission's funny, man. I like that mission. Warrior, I hope you... What a team you and Chicharron made. When this battle is won, everyone will see. Everyone will know. Everyone will bow down to Chicharron. Alright, Chicharron, it's you and me. <laughs> Let's do this. So, what are we attacking today? Coconut stands? Jaguars? An airplane? No, no, no! Not again! Why do you hate my pot so much? All I did was give a discount to the soldados! <laughs> What did that mongoose ever do to you?
Por supuesto. Chicharron gets what Chicharron wants. He sure does. This could be useful. I hope you're not scared of burns or chemical.
Yara's Come finest here. lover lives on. My baby Tigre. A big battle is on the horizon. I'm just happy everyone is getting along. You did this. Back in 67, it was Santos who could bring the people together. Today, you have that magic. <laughs> so, I'm Santos? No. You are me, the feast. Now, before every mission, I find that if I imagine myself accomplishing it, I will accomplish it. There. I just imagined us destroying the Navy. We doing this? You kids today. You're so fast with everything. Take in this moment. The world will change in a couple of hours. I'm gonna go for Benitez. Do it! We'll find another way in and connect with you as soon as we can! Ah! A guerrilla has made it inside! Find them! Kill them! <laughs> if you're not dealing with a guerrilla inside, then you're killing guerrillas outside! <laughs> being 
bombed in here. Hey! Don't do that! <laughs> I have no idea where this goddamn key is.
this. <coughs> hey, baby Tigre, you still there? See, si. seems to be fucking dead around every corner you here. Make sure you're on the other side of those corners. Claro, El Tigre. Get me the fuck out of here. Help me. Open my cell. You can do it in the control room. Adios, Benitez. You dead, bitch. Ojo por ojo. ¡Viva la moral! ¡Benitez! Couldn't have done this without you, Danny. That's not a smart move. You should cut her down. Why? It's what that bitch deserves. You killed a soldier. Good for you. Except the thing about soldiers is there's always more of them. See, sí, mama. Same mistakes, new faces. You're just bitter because your revolution came and went, and all you got was a fucking mountain. <laughs> Enjoy your trophy. You need this as private stash. Huh? Ah. Salud. Enough with the pics. Victory Danny. I thought I was Bebe Tigre. Nah. Danny Roja will be bigger than El Tigre. You know why? Because your war will fucking end. Viva la moral! Si! Sí, viva la moral! Woo! There's something about third world prisons. They make me hard. As you can see, Mr. McKay, everything is under control. Good old shakedown. I love it. Did they do it? Who the fuck cares? <laughs> the Admiral was alarmed. She did not have the stomach needed to deal with the terroristas. I would like you to consider expanding your operations. Are you a legend? Open the cell. With respect, the president has a Open it! Did you fight with Santos Espinosa in the 67 Revolution? I drove a tank right through the doors of the Capitolio in the Battle of Esperanza. I was there when we took your grandfather. I watched him die. Why did you hate him? The only thing a Castillo has done for Yara is rape our land. And you will do the same thing now. You don't know that. I do! And if you loosen these chains, I will wrap my hands around your little throat and save Yara from another Castillo! Or you can do your country a favor and kill yourself. <laughs> we should have someone look at that mule. It's not mine. <laughs> But I get the feeling I should be. Hell yes! Okay, it's on, Danny. Have a drink with me at Chuchi's. It's a bar west of Concepcion Bay and north of Grand Hotel Caballero. You got it, Yelena. Clara, Yara is a little more free today. The Admiral is dead. That is a huge blow to the military. Anton's going to be out for revenge. Watch your back. I always do. Word is, Castillo has a defection problem. 
Who knows? We might even have a Castile surrender. You're dreaming, Clara. Fuck yeah, I am. You follow up on this. What can you tell me? Hola, Dani. We're putting together an ambush. We're going to teach Castillo soldiers why you don't fuck with El Este. Join us. Thank you. You train that... to kill for you? Chicharron! <laughs> no knife. Como esta? I'm Mer Benitez, had it coming. <laughs> The ancianos keep talking about their glory days. Let's ride. Here's why you're really here. I just got off the phone with Castillo. What? He said, if I turn you in, he will release all of the outcasts in El Este. You're joking, right? It's for the greater good, Danny. What? Aren't you ready to sacrifice yourself for the good of Yara? <laughs> Coño, you're fucking with me. Of course I am. Shit, lighten up, Danny. Besides, I give up Lorenzo first. Where are we going? First to Honron, then our island. With Benitez dead, it's safe to go back there. You have an island? It was our place to hang out, hook up, drink. I'd go there to study. Hell of a mix. <laughs> Honron and her brother showed it to me. Honron has a brother? Yeah. He and I... We had a thing. No shit. Where is he? I need another drink for that story. We're here.
Callate. I was studying while you were playing games. Hey, it's trying that counts. <laughs> what are you? The fucking UN? Let's get Danny a trophy for trying. What's next? Is this gonna be party Jelena or wiki Jelena? Fuck off. You getting the grill? You know how I feel about using that thing. Animals have goddamn brains too. You know dolphins can use tools? Cojone, there was a beautiful second I forgot you were vegan. Can you show Danny where the grill is? Yeah, yeah, you monsters. Danny, grab that. I'll show you where to find meat or fish to cook. Or plant-based food for the good of your soul. Where did Danny go? I'll show you where to find some good hunting. You just need to point me in the right direction. <sighs> this island reminds me so much of Gerardo. Oh. Honron's brother? Yeah. What happened to him? In the early days of La Moral, Honron and Gerardo were so reckless. The two of them did this stupid smash and grab on a checkpoint and got arrested. I tried to bribe the guards to free them, but they could only get one out. I had to choose. My heart said Picarardo, but Honron is the best guerrilla we have. You picked Honron over your boyfriend? I did. I had a plan for the next day. We were going to break him out, but Benitez executed all the prisoners as punishment for Honron being freed. She doesn't know. Gerardo was thrown up at the fort. Pinga. I think about that choice every day. And the truth is, if I had to do it over again, I'd still pick on Ron. It's the right call. It's just... There's only one person responsible for Gerardo's death, and that's Castillo. Gracias, Danny. But I was born with an eye for bullshit. In La Revolución, we are all guilty. Just some a bit more than others. I think Libertad might have a bit... Something up? So... I think Libertad might have a bit more faith in humanity. And that's why I'll never join. Look, there's crocodiles and fish on this side of the island. And grab a couple of carrots for our fucking rabbit, Honron. You got it, Yelena. I'm just going to take a minute alone. It's been a long time since I've been here. Gotta get one more. One more bit of food for the grill, and I can kick back.
They're waiting for me to start. Those legends can still put up a fight. Pinga. I'll show you where the grill is. Walk with me. I'm getting drunk tonight. That's for fucking sure. I hope Anna shows up. You know, Yelena likes you. We all like you. You should be joining La Moral. I'm good with Libertad, Homron. You might think she's all talk, but... Lara Garcia... She picked me up when I had nothing. Nobody. Wouldn't be here if it wasn't for her. <laughs> that reminds me of this fucking grill. What? It was the early days of La Moral. We were starving after a beautiful day of fighting. We killed a hundred soldados, and... Every day you guys kill a hundred soldados. <laughs> Whatever. The point is, we came here to celebrate. Everybody's throwing meat on the grill, and... I ask them to make room for my veggies. And everyone starts making fun of my veganness. I'm a fun drunk, okay? But if I hear, eat some fucking arroz con puerco honron one too many times, I kind of lose my shit. Just a bit. I will remember that for later. <laughs> well, you've been warned. So, I'm pissed. My big brother, Gerardo, sees people picking on me, and he fucking snaps. Grabs the grill with his bare hands. Hot as shit, meat still cooking, and chokes it into the ocean. Everybody was gonna kill me. Gerardo steps up, the way a good big brother does. <laughs> he always had my back when no one else did. He died, like, a week after that. I fucking miss him. I'm sorry, Homeron. But I'm sure he's happy we took down Benitez. <laughs> Gerardo wishes he was at this party, for sure. He'd always say, we're not here to feel like shit. We're here to erase the past and drink to our future. And to eat our veggies, <laughs> right? <laughs> exactly, Danny. The grill's over there. Watch out for the sharks. <laughs> Hope you got that on your camera. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> 
Hola. Playtime's over, Danny. Oh, no shit. You all just left me? You're the one who kicked us off our island. I... do not remember that. That's the least of our problems. I got some shit news. Our base was compromised last night. <sighs> Repinga. How fucked are we? Gilberto's chameleons got word ahead of time. They were able to clean everything out before the soldados raided the place. Don't go back there. Where are you setting up shop? Thanks to you, at the Grand Hotel Caballero. Swing by soon. McKay and Castillo are already fortifying their poison production operations in La Jolla. You got it. How much you want for the bird?
Deus meu, mas teu tempo ali, Benítez Fidel. Whether you took your glucosamine pill? <laughs> what an announcement. McKay Industries invests 100 million into El Presidente's vision. So we hit McKay? He's the money behind Castillo. No. First we kill Castillo, then McKay won't matter. Yeah, what the fuck do we care about a Yankee in a suit? It's the money. No money, no tanks, no bullets, no soldiers. I got it. Elena, Honron, Lorenzo, me, and all of La Morale will go after Castillo. Danny. You kill McKay. That doesn't make sense. So I was getting tired of talking. Revive! Chaos! Batter up! <laughs>
Tigre, no. <laughs> Bad time for an I told you so. I came to say goodbye to an old friend. Back in 67, we didn't mourn our dead. Death was glorious. We were stupid. Castillo and McKay crossed the line today. More will die and nobody is safe. Not an old legend. Or a new one. Or the leader of LSD. Jesus, they come a couple of big characters there. Holy shit. Revolution. We have to stop Castillo and that Yankee. We? You kids look like you could use a little luck. I don't want to hear a word about how Libertad and Clara fucking Garcia could have helped us. Not that you would, just... Mira, Honron and El Tigre are gone. Let's save our tears for after their war. Compartmentalize. Move on. That Yankee fucker McKay and his business are now our main focus. I need to learn more about his operations so I can plan our attacks. I need you to take out signal jammers. They are blocking all wireless data transfers in La Jolla. Destroying a couple of them will give me a connection to the packet they am giving you. Pop that thing into any computer in McKay's building, and I will have access to his network. 
We will find that Yankee's weak points and bring him to his fucking knees.